All right, all right. This is 304 Studios Live in Jonesboro, Arkansas. That's right. This is an STSPod.club production. This is episode 740 of STSPod.club and episode 128 of Rolling Into Mempo. I want to remind everyone to go to stspod.club, the link of all links, and go to Patreon in the right-hand corner. Also, if you join Facebook, Twitter, any of my social media, you can reach out to me, DM me directly. I guess direct message is a DM, right? DM me. I've got Rolling Into Mempo t-shirts, only three or four still available. Rolling Into Mempo logo t-shirts. Please contact me directly, and I'll get one out to you. That's right. We also have a new episode coming midweek with WTF. That's right. It's our most popular show on stspod.club. And guys, if you joined us for the 127 weeks before this one, you know we do hits, misses, MVP, question of the week, what's happening, and must see. Now to the upcoming events, and then on with the show. We are Memphis Wrestling. Join us live starting tonight at Dave & Buster's in Memphis. Watch WWE SummerSlam absolutely free with us. That's tonight at Dave & Buster's in Memphis. Tomorrow, August 6th, former WWE superstars Chris Masters and Dirty Dango are coming to Memphis Wrestling. Meet them both and our VIP experience and save $5 with the code MASTERS at checkout. Saturday, August 19th, Memphis Wrestling at the Pontotoc Run Club are tag teaming with WWE Hall of Fame legend Hacksaw Jim Duggan to fundraise for St. Jude. Meet Hacksaw at 4 p.m. Reserve your seat today. Ho! Saturday, August 26th, Gleason, Tennessee. Get ready for the Tater Town Throwdown. Benefiting Gleason High School. Sunday, August 27th, meet the real one, formerly known as Enzo Amore. How you doing? All tickets are on sale now. Get yours right now at championshipwrestlingmemphis.com. All right, let's talk about hits, hits, hits. Oh, we started out. I really, really like the way they started this out uh, with highlights of the Lance turn. Uh, The Lance turn was very well done last week. I like the way they didn't actually go black and white. They did some color with this, but it also showed us uh, as soon as the show come on, what was going on. Really, really liked it. Uh, The superpowers, (laughs) Mike Anthony and Kay Toomer against the L.A. Hustlers. Oh, my God, this team looked great. Uh, Promo was good. Crowd was so loud, guys. Standing room only there. Uh, as the crowd was chanting right with them, Mike is so good on the mic. Uh, Mike is good on the mic. And K Tumor, awesome. This team looks like the next uh, tag team champions. I'm sorry to say that, DK and Ray Ray, but uh, uh, they're talking about the uh, legacy there, the Roberts legacy. But, uh, man, I would love to see them with the tag belts. Uh Next thing up, we had the Dirty Bird Brawl Clips. Very good. Very good way to put over your house shows. Big John Dalton was going for the win there. Uh, Matt Williams ran out, interrupted. Big John Dalton in that video, he has such good punches. Oh, uh, punches, punches are awesome. He looks like a guy that's been punching for, you know, Years and years. A veteran punches. How about that? Matt Williams came out. They challenged uh, Big John Dalton. Uh, We had the match start, and then Cruel came out out with the casket. And it looked like that all three of them, Matt Williams with Gaston and Big John Dalton, were going to square off against Cruel together. Uh, But no. Love this. Matt and Gaston, this is the perfect thing that they would do is heels. 
I love that act. I really do. Matt Williams does a good job with it. Uh, we ended up getting Big John Dalton did the had the choke slam from Cruel, and Cruel did a real quick promo talking about everybody dies but him. Love that. Love to hit, hit, hit. Uh, Posse then outside the the uh, wrestle center with Lance, uh, full makeup. You just have to watch this. I love this. This is going to be a long process with these guys, and it's going to be fun, guys. I just feel like that Lance – I can't wait to see what they do with the character. Uh, is he going to be like a, a lackey or is he going to be full-time posse member? I can't wait to see. We had some ballpark clips. Again, this shows you. I talk about this all the time. Memphis Wrestling has the connections to do stuff like this. We had Rocky flying. This is the kind of stuff that makes them – so much better than any of the other local promotions. They're able to work with people like the Memphis Redbirds. Loved it, loved it. Uh, then we had Mackenzie Morgan in a good match with Brooklyn. Solid match. Mackenzie looked fantastic. Uh, first look at Brooklyn. I don't remember her ever being on Memphis Wrestling. We did also have next up uh, Co King Cobra. Challenging Big Red, King Cobra. Woo! We're going to see King Cobra back in the ring. Should be fun. Big Red really solid in the ring, so it, it should be a good match. And then we had Ray Collins. And, and make sure I'm right here, but did they call him all the way Ray Collins? All the way Ray? Hey. He went against uh, Righteous Ryan Rembrandt, known on Rolling Into Mempho as Triple R. Big win for Collins. I liked it. I liked it. This was fun. Uh, the, we then was informed that was the main event. Then we were informed that Austin and Nikki Lane were arriving, and we'd be right back. Austin came out. By the way, Nikki, you look fabulous. She looked absolutely fabulous in this. Uh, Austin telling telling uh, Dustin that he wanted a title shot right now. He wanted Boz out. He, want, he wanted uh, to get in Boz's face. <laughs> he, he was uh, – Austin was – heel Austin. Let's just put that. Hashtag heel Austin, by the way. Uh, he challenged Boz, Boz and Austin for the internet championship, and we have a new champion. That's right. We have a new champion. The new champion, Austin Lane, I believe this is only Boz's second loss since coming into the business. Uh, very, very good. Finish exactly what you wanted. Uh, Lane and, and Nikki both looked fabulous. And Lane looked good in the ring, even though he wasn't in, uh, in gear. I like the way they did this, as if Lane just walks off the street, wants a title shot, and wins the belt. Very, very well done. All right. Hits. That was our hits for week 128. We are Memphis Wrestling. Join us live starting tonight at Dave & Buster's in Memphis. Watch WWE SummerSlam absolutely free with us. That's tonight at Dave & Buster's in Memphis. Tomorrow, August 6th, former WWE superstars Chris Masters and Dirty Dango are coming to Memphis Wrestling. Meet them both at our VIP experience and save $5 with the code MASTERS at checkout. MVP, our MVP for the week. Well, let's, let's talk about it. MVP, Austin Lane, that's our MVP for the week. New internet champion, Austin Lane, MVP for week 128. Oh. So did you notice I forgot the misses? Did I forget the misses? Oh, misses for the week. Misses for week 128. Nothing. This is getting more, more, more where I say no misses. How can you put together a wrestling show one hour and not have something that's that's just not good. They spend the time to do this fantastic show and flawless, absolutely flawless. So I didn't miss the misses because there was no misses for week 128.
All right, we're up to question of the week. Question of the week, week 128. As you can see on the screen right here, that's the phone number. That's the email. Send it in, and we'll answer your question of the week. So Memphis Ladies Mark wrote, hey, Mark, uh, wrote in to say, you said last week's match with Cassandra Golden and Bashley Bones was the best ladies match in 127 episodes. I was just wondering, who do you consider the top three ladies in the history of those 127 episodes? Great question. Great question from Memphis Ladies Mark. Well, I've thought about this uh, since I got this early this week, and I got to go with Nick. She's our current champion. That's that's one of the three I'm gonna pick. Uh, current cha champion. She's been with the company for a long time. She's improved immensely in the interview and in the ring. Nick, I got to go with Nick. I got to go with Cassandra Golden. Cassandra Golden had. Um, well, she had the belt for a long time. She's been part of, of the 127 episodes and actually debuted on the first episode. I think I'm correct about that. At Cassandra Golden. We got Nixon, Cassandra Golden. And I got to give it, Nikki Lane was the first ladies champion. Uh, got to pick her as one of the top ladies in the history of those 127 episodes. And after she's got out of the ring, now she's managing Austin Lane and helping him win titles. So you got to go with Nikki Lane. That was our question of the week. Remember, phone number or email, and I'll answer your question of the week. You also have a question for a superstar of Memphis Wrestling. Let me know. I'll reach out and try to get them to answer the question of the week. Question of the week, 128. All right. What's happening? What's happening? Week 128, King Cobra against Big Red. Man, that's what's happening. And it looks like next week. What's happening? Casket match. Cruel against Lance Archer. These are two huge guys. You see how big Curl was up against Dustin Starr? Uh, Lance Archer tires over uh, Lance. Uh, Lance actually tires over Dustin also. Those two big guys are going to be going at it, trying to put one in the casket. That's what's happening. That's what's happening this week. All right, up to must-see. Must-see for week 128. It was the angle at the end, Lane coming out, Lane winning the belt. Go out of your way to see this. Very well done. Uh, almost like I'm out here, I want to fight, I, I want to win the belt, and that's what he does. Loved it, loved it. The must-see for the week is the angle at the end with Lane and Lane winning the belt. Must-see for 128. All right, guys, you know what I'm fixing to do. Same bad time, same bad channel. On the best little wrestling podcast in the business. Be there. And as everyone knows, everybody knows this. You know this. I love my mama.